Creating Global Cooperatives. One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 465. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do it yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. My name is Jay Sable, and I'm the executive director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. One community is bringing together people with the consciousness and the desire for the highest good of all life on this planet to build sustainable and self-replicating teacher demonstration hubs as a pathway to global sustainability. And this is our February 20th, 2022 edition of our weekly progress update. And today's topic is creating global cooperatives. And one community is meant to be that. It's meant to be a global cooperative and the start of a global cooperative of global cooperatives. And so everything you see in the background of this video are the open source tools, tutorials, resources, and do-it-yourself instructions of what we're creating to usher in a new paradigm of global cooperatives working together as a global collaborative of cooperatives, creating a better life for everybody. And we call this living and creating for the highest good of all. And so how we're creating this is we have looked at what it requires to create a sustainable civilization, and we are creating open source tools and resources, blueprints, and do-it-yourself instructions for all aspects of that. And we divide it into two categories. There's physical sustainability, which is food, energy, and housing. Most people are familiar with that. And then there's the emotional foundations of sustainability that we've identified and we call highest good approaches to fulfilled living, highest good approaches to education, highest good approaches to economics, and true earth stewardship, and putting all that together demonstrate a way of living that most people consider to be better than the way they're living right now. And it'll be better than the way they're living right now because it'll provide more free time and things to do with that time than people currently have. And all of it will be, will be free within that environment and it will be within the control of everybody who operates that environment. So that the collective, the collaborative, the cooperative work together, we work together to create the most amazing, most enriching, most enjoyable, most beautiful, environment possible, the most holistic, the most sustainable environment possible. And we share that as our gift to ourselves and to each other and with the world through our open source ecotourism model so that when people come and visit and experience what one community is, everything that they see is open source and free shared so that it can be replicated as either individual components or as the complete model. So if somebody wants to grow something unique that they've never seen before and they see it at one community, we will teach them how to do that. If somebody wants to start a community-based education program based on the one community education program, we'll teach them how to do that as well. If somebody participates in a class, maybe it's a class about relationship building or maybe it's a class about uh, maybe it's a, just the experience of like spending quality time with children or family or a nature walk or a book club or a game club, that will be open source and free shared as well live streamed in the cases where we can. Putting all this together, open sourcing and free sharing it, so every aspect. So if somebody sees you know, a housing model that they would like to build a sustainable you know, guest house and they're not interested in community, then our open source plans can be used for that as well. And if somebody wants to build the complete model and become a part of creating global cooperatives by joining our global collaborative, then one community is a place for that as well. Or if they like it, what we're doing, but would like to do it, have an idea for how to do it better, how to do it differently, how to meet better their values, it's all open source and free shared so that they can, all these components can be put together and modified, adapted in whatever way people want to do that as well. So our idea of creating global cooperatives is by creating a collaborative of small teacher demonstration hubs from anywhere from 50 to a couple thousand people working together to create a better world for all of us by open sourcing and free sharing all of the individual components and evolving all the individual components so that there's a larger and larger global suite of open source tools and resources for replicating everything it is that we're doing. And this is what one community is doing. And we're a volunteer, an all volunteer, 100% volunteer organization that's had over 600 volunteers at this point. We're coming up on 700 pretty soon contribute to our project to get us to where we are right now. We're a non-governmental organization. We're a non-profit organization. And we're creating this because we want to live this way. Because we want to share living this way in such a way that everybody 
can participate that wants to, so that we can create enough teacher demonstration villages and hubs around the world so that every single person that wants to participate and be involved in something like this can. And the way that we do that is through a self-replicating global cooperative model. And our self-replicating model is made possible by making it easy enough, affordable enough, and attractive enough so that the idea will spread its own. And that attractive enough means that the more amazing we make our environment and the more we share our environment, the more what we're doing will spread. And so our whole open source model is built on that foundation. And the idea of creating global cooperatives is creating these teacher demonstration hubs designed to teach other people how to take a teacher demonstration hub, establish a teacher demonstration hub, and to demonstrate and teach how to create an additional teacher demonstration hub. And then working in cooperation, collaboration with all of these to make it even better, to make even more open source tools and resources possible to evolve it all, to show different versions of the earth bag village, the shipping container village, the open source education model, the highest good approach to food, the fulfilled living activities and models. This is what we're doing. I mean, imagine being able to walk out your front door and know that there are, you know, 25, 50, or 100 different classes that you could be taking at that moment. Like the club med of sustainability and everything is within walking distance. None of it costs anything. And if you have an idea for something to do that you think other people would be interested in, it's a part of the living environment and part of your contribution and really your responsibility to that environment to create that, to share your gifts and to invite other people to participate as your own open source gift, as your own cooperative, collaborative, free shared, like, hey, come do this thing because I love to do it. And maybe it's playing a soccer game or a football game, or maybe it's running a book club, or maybe it's a writing club, or maybe it is just spending time with your kids, or maybe it's a nature walk, or maybe it's going out and doing something like, you know, jet skis or or uh, snow skis, or maybe it's, you know, all the toys and things that people love to have, but can't afford personally, but within a collaborative and cooperative environment through pooling our resources, you would have access to all of those things. Like rather than every single person owning a drill, you have access to a drill. Rather than every single person needing to own a lathe, which is something that most people don't, of course that would be available because by pooling our resources and wanting to have that within the community, there's value. And so now you have access to that. You know, a table saw, a drill press, you know, a foundry, you know, much more complex things than that. All of these are part of what one community is creating and has planned so we can demonstrate what's possible when we say, let's create the most enriching, amazing environment imaginable by pooling our resources and cooperating and collaborating to create that and share that as our gift with the world. So this is what we're up to. If you like what it is that we're doing, you'd like a weekly dose of positivity and conversations about how we can create world change, like and subscribe. Like support us in the easiest way possible, just like and subscribe. It's a great way to support our project. Uh, if you'd like to see the specifics, the details of everything that we're creating, visit our website, stick around for a couple more minutes and there's bullet points on all the major components, but visit our web website for all the open source tools and resources and the thousands now at this point, tens of thousands of hours that have been put in to the design process and development process. See what it is that we're doing, the detail, and the quality of the content that we're creating and what we're planning. And uh, if you'd like to help, of course, visit our helping page where you can get involved as a volunteer, where you can donate, we can support us through a whole bunch of different ways. Uh, check out all the different ways to support One Community, what it is that we're doing. There's lots of different options. And um, yeah, thanks for just watching till the end. So with that said, this is how we're creating global cooperatives. Thanks for watching the end. Until next week, we will, of course, keep on keep it on. Thank you. The One Community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative, and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. The next component is highest good education. This component is complete and pretty much ready to launch once we're on the property.
one community's approach to highest good education is designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, includes national standards, all subjects, lesson plans, teaching strategies, learning strategies and tools, classroom design, and more. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet.